Welcome to Animal Realm, your ultimate destination for all things wild. Let's know about the spiders, with their diverse species and unique adaptations, have long fascinated humans. While most spiders are harmless and play beneficial roles in ecosystems by controlling insect populations, a few species possess venom that can pose serious health risks to humans. The Biology of Venomous Spiders Venomous spiders have evolved complex biological mechanisms to produce and deliver venom, primarily used for capturing prey and self-defense. Venom Glands and Fangs Venomous spiders have specialized glands that produce venom, connected to their fangs, chalicery. When a spider bites, muscles around the venom glands contract, forcing venom through the fangs and into the prey or threat. Types of Venom Spider venom can be classified into neurotoxic and necrotic types. Neurotoxic venom affects the nervous system, causing symptoms like muscle spasms and paralysis. Necrotic venom destroys tissue, leading to painful sores and necrosis. Venom Composition Spider venom is a complex mixture of proteins, peptides, and enzymes. It contains neurotoxins, cytotoxins, hematoxins, and other compounds that can disrupt various physiological processes. The composition and potency of venom vary among species and individuals. Notable Venomous Spider Species Several spider species are particularly notorious for their dangerous bites. Understanding their habitats, behaviors, and venom effects is crucial for awareness and safety. Black Widow Spider, Latrodectus spp. Black Widow Spiders are found in temperate regions worldwide. The female Black Widow is easily recognized by its shiny black body and red hourglass marking on the abdomen. Its neurotoxic venom can cause severe muscle pain, cramps, and spasms, and in rare cases, can be fatal. Brown Recluse Spider, Loxaceles reclusa native to the central and southern United States, the brown recluse is known for its necrotic venom, which can cause severe tissue damage and ulcers. Identified by the violin-shaped marking on its back, the brown recluse is shy and often found in undisturbed areas. Sydney Funnelweb Spider, Atrax robustus found in eastern Australia, the Sydney funnelweb is one of the most dangerous spiders due to its highly toxic neurotoxic venom. Bites can cause severe symptoms, including rapid onset breathing difficulties and muscle spasms, and require immediate medical attention. Brazilian Wandering Spider, Phenutria spp. Native to South America, the Brazilian Wandering Spider is highly aggressive and possesses potent neurotoxic venom. Bites can result in severe pain, muscle paralysis, and in extreme cases, death. These spiders are known for their wandering behavior and are often encountered in homes and gardens. Redback Spider, Latrodectus haselti closely related to the Black Widow. The redback spider is found in Australia. The female redback has a distinctive red stripe on its back. Its neurotoxic venom can cause severe pain, sweating, and nausea, and is potentially life-threatening. Six-Eyed Sand Spider, Sicarius honey found in deserts of southern Africa. The six-eyed sand spider has necrotic venom that can cause severe tissue destruction. Although bites are rare due to its reclusive nature, they can be highly dangerous if they occur. Effects of Spider Venom on Humans The effects of spider venom on humans can vary widely depending on the type of venom, the amount injected, and the location of the bite. Common symptoms of venomous spider bites include Neurotoxic Venom Neurotoxic venom affects the nervous system, leading to symptoms such as muscle pain, cramps, spasms, tremors, and paralysis. Severe cases can result in respiratory failure and death. Necrotic Venom Necrotic venom causes localized tissue damage, leading to symptoms like redness, swelling, blistering, and the development of painful ulcers. In severe cases, necrosis, tissue death, can occur, requiring surgical intervention. Immediate reactions. Immediate reactions to a spider bite can include intense pain at the bite site, redness, and swelling. Some victims may also experience systemic symptoms such as nausea, vomiting, headache, dizziness, and fever. Systemic reactions. Systemic reactions can develop within hours of the bite, including difficulty breathing, severe muscle cramps, abdominal pain, and high blood pressure. Without prompt medical treatment, these symptoms can escalate to life-threatening conditions. First aid and medical treatment. Prompt and appropriate first aid and medical treatment are crucial for spider bite victims. Here are essential steps to take in the event of a spider bite. Stay calm. Keeping calm can help slow the spread of venom. Panic and movement can increase heart rate and circulation, spreading the venom more quickly. Clean the bite site. Gently wash the bite site with soap and water to prevent infection. Apply a cold compress. Applying a cold compress to the bite site can help reduce pain and swelling. Elevate the affected limb. Keep the bitten limb elevated to reduce swelling. Avoid home remedies. Do not apply ice directly to the skin, use tourniquets, or attempt to cut the bite site. These methods are ineffective and can cause further injury. Seek immediate medical help. Transport the victim to the nearest medical facility as quickly as possible. Antivenom is the most effective treatment for bites from certain species and should be administered by healthcare professionals. Monitor vital signs. Keep an eye on the victim's vital signs, such as breathing, 
pulse, and blood pressure, and be prepared to perform CPR if necessary. Prevention and Safety Tips Preventing spider bites involves awareness, caution, and preparedness, especially in areas where venomous spiders are common. Avoid high-risk areas, be cautious in areas known to be inhabited by venomous spiders, such as dark corners, basements, wood piles, and sheds. Wear protective clothing. When working or hiking in spider-prone areas, wear long pants, long-sleeved shirts, gloves, and boots to reduce the risk of spider bites. Inspect and shake out clothing. Shake out clothing, shoes, and bedding before use, especially if they have been stored for some time. Use insect repellent. Use insect repellent on clothing and expose skin to deter spiders and other pests. Keep your home clean. Regularly clean and declutter your home to reduce hiding places for spiders. Seal cracks and gaps in windows, doors, and walls to prevent spiders from entering. Store firewood properly. Store firewood away from your home and off the ground to prevent spiders from nesting in it. Educate others. Educate family members, friends, and colleagues about spider safety and first aid for spider bites. Thank you for joining us on this wild journey through the animal realm. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exciting animal adventures. Until next time, stay wild and explore the beauty of nature.